We're going to be talking today about a project on I-10 between Baton Rouge and Prairieville, LA-73. And what we're doing is we're widening the interstate on the inside. It's going to go from two lanes into three lanes in each direction. And one of the things that we'd like to talk about today is some of the safety features that we have here. Now this project is going to be done in two phases. The first phase is a little over three miles and it's going to go from the Highland Road Bridge to what we call the tree line. And then the next phase, which will begin early next year, 2019, is what we call from the tree line to LA-73. So we want people to be prepared as they get closer to this work zone so they can take the appropriate steps to be safe. You can see that we are warning people there is a work zone ahead. We're telling people that there's a speed limit change and that there's a lane shift coming. We drop the speed limit from 70 miles an hour to 60. We have signs up to warn of congestion should you need to be prepared to stop. One of the things that we did do to try to minimize any kind of congestion is we shifted one of the lanes to what used to be the shoulder. So you will have narrow shoulders so we can maintain two lanes of traffic through this area at all times. This is going to be the Highland Road Bridge, which will be replaced. There may need to be lane closures on Highland as we do that, but we're going to be doing those at night and we will certainly let people know ahead of time. you will see that there's some open areas where there's not a concrete barrier and that is for our workers for people who are working on this project to get in and out of the interstate they will do so as safely as possible but it's also important for you to be aware of your surroundings and to watch out for the workers and worker vehicles now you can see that the lane shifts up ahead back to the normal interstate as we reach the tree line and this will be the second phase of our project as we start to shift over and there's the end of the construction zone sign. 